There is no such thing as a bad time to sell a house. Everyone thinks, you know, April, May, June, July, August, right? That's when you sell houses. People like living indoors. <laughs> I know it sounds ridiculous, but people like living indoors and they want to live indoors all year round. Um, we sell 20, 30, 40 houses every single month. We have to, we have bills to pay, right? But more importantly, people want to be able to buy real estate. There isn't a three or four month period where like all the real estate's done. I'll tell you what there is. There is a three to four month period when there's tons of properties on the market. They just aren't selling. Okay. And there's more competition. Are there more people looking? Yeah. There aren't that many more people buying though. They're looking. People like looking at open houses. People like putting their homes on the market. Hey, if I got a million dollars, I'd sell my house. Put a sign out front, kid. I'm not paying you any money. It's a commission, right? Um, and there's 10,000, you know, desperate agents. They'll put a sign out front and hold some open houses and hope that someone buys it, but they don't. There's some seasonality, definitely five, 10, 20%, right? But you know, last December we did what? Thousands of homes in this area, thousands, right? And this, this July, we'll do thousands of homes. Is there a little bit more? Yeah, there's a little bit more. Is there a massive difference more? There isn't. We sell homes all year round. What matters most is when you're ready to sell your home and why your motivation, the money behind it. There is no higher price in the summer. Doesn't exist. What matters is the broker you hire to get you that price. Okay. So I would recommend you figure out what motivates you, what your timeline is, right? And talk to an expert here, mate, real estate so that we can get you what you want in the time you want. It'll be great.